Hello everyone, assigning the switch sound call out is a must have on Landing your free gear. sky radio. Landing gear down. Check out this video for easy setup. Alright, let's get started from our PC window. Let's bring up Fire Explorer and create a temporary holding folder. And for me, I will just name it the new folder as Sounds. Next, we need to bring up Google and let's search for iNav Fix Wing Group. All right, so let's go to that link page. And what it is is iNav is a worldwide community with friendly members and all culture and background. And it support a lot of um, you know resource for us. So let's scroll down here and look for iNav Fixed Wing Group Transmitter Sound Pack. Okay, here, here it is. So let's click that and it'll bring us to this page. Let's scroll down here, and as you can see right here, you can download. Look for the Ethos Sound Pack right here. So let's download the Ethos Sound Pack. Let's click that, and it's download on the lower left right here. And if you click this, and we can see, let's show in the folder here. Okay, and let's see where it downloaded. It's download into the download directory. So here, I'm going to copy this zip on to my sound directory. So let's yank it and copy to our sound directory that we created. Okay, so let's close this explorer here and here. Let's extract all. Okay, and we're going to extract it to the sound directory that we had before. So let's unclick that and let's hit extract. Here we can go into the 4.02 pack directory uh, and there's a listing of the sound pack file and the change log file. As we can explore and open the sound pack just to see and as you can see uh, these are uh, the sound files that are provided. Battery profile, uh, landing gear up and down, flap, blah blah blah. You know as you scroll down you can see many sound files here and we can pick and choose while sound uh, we want to copy and bring over to our transmitter x20 for usage okay uh, and for the change log here it's just a record that all good software developer uh, provide for history so let's go to the sd card directory and under audio here are the sound files and there are a lot of them and you can copy and bring it over to your x20 but i don't recommend it as you don't want to overflow your SD card in the transmitter. You can click on the view here and details to see the title of each file, but just copy what you need. Uh, for our purpose, let's copy the, let's look for flap up, half flap, and full flap files, and let's just copy the, those over to the X20 to demonstrate our purpose. Right, so next we need to copy our files to the transmitter. So let's bring up another file explorer here. And okay, there it is. And we need to put up another screen here. And let's bring our transmitter and bring it up in bootloader mode and connect our USB. And we're going to be in USB connected mode now and wait for the X20 drive to mount on the File Explorer screen here. Here the SD card directory J is mounted and we need to go to the directory audio. And there are many language version here, but anyway for our purpose, let's copy, let's look for the gear up and gear down and flap sound files from the PC and let's copy it over and place it them under the J audio directory. Of course you can copy other files that you need if you want but for now these flap files will do for our demo.
Okay, so let's close this file explorer and on this one, let's uh, eject the drive uh, so that we can safely disconnect the USB. Okay, so on the transmitter, let's disconnect the USB here. And let's power down the transmitter here. Okay, so we are at our transmitter right now after powering up. And let's uh, hit setting here. And under file manager, let's verify under audio if we copy the file sound over successfully. And yes, we do have it flap and all the gear sound are here. So let's look for the airplane icon here and let's scroll over and click special function. And I already add the gear up and gear down. So let's add another special function here and hit there and hit the play track. And you want to enable there. And the active condition, let's assign it to a switch position. And the switch position is right here. I'm going to select. Uh, you can select whatever you like, but for me, I'd like the switch. SB up arrow and SB up arrow is flap up for me. So I'm going to assign the flap up here file to play. Okay. So let's go out and continue. Add another special function here. Action is to play the track and enable. And same thing here. Assign the switch position here to the middle switch here of SB minus. Flaps up. SB minus. That's what I want for half flap. So let's assign the file to be played, and that is uh, the half lap file right here. Okay, so same thing, add another special function here. Uh, let's add the full flap. So play track, enable, uh, uh, the switch position will be uh, SB, SB down. So that will be full flap for me. And the file, let's look for the sound file, uh, full flap, and let's assign to it. Okay, and let's go out. So here we have all our gear, special function, and flap up and flap down. So let's Half check. Half flaps. Flaps up. Half flaps. Full flaps. Half flaps. Flaps up. Half flaps. Full flaps. So there we go, easy assigning sound to switch setup to help alert us during flying. So that was easy. So again, thank you for watching. And if you find this video helpful, please help share with other who needs it. And also, I would appreciate if you support my channel by subscribing and commenting. Thank you very much and happy flying. Bye now.